When I started Douche to D Shampoo, I planned everything out. From my exercise routines, to my speed golf training, to how many balls I would hit per week, even down to how many grams of protein I am adding to my diet. But one thing I did not take for account at all was how far the weekend hack was out of his physical prime. Google defines your physical prime being between the ages of 25 and 35. I myself am 39 well out of my physical prime. Now I know what you're saying. Michael Jordan won his sixth championship when he was 35. Barry Bonds hit 73 home runs when he was 36. Tom Brady won a Super Bowl when he was 42. And George Foreman won the heavyweight boxing championship when he was 45. What do I, the weekend hack, have in common with those guys I just mentioned? Absolutely nothing. For the past 20 years, I have not been playing professional sports. I have been sitting in an office cube in an engineering consulting firm. These past few weeks have been rough. I have completed two weeks. Last week was another four workouts with weights. It was four speed trainings for my golf. I hit about another 350 balls, the majority of those being drivers. I ran another 12 miles. And let me tell you, my knee is sore. My right hip is sore. My left shoulder is pretty sore. And for the last three days, I've been laid up because God, my back is absolutely killing me. Doctor said I need a bacchiotomy. When I planned this all out, I did not think at all about how I would hold up to training like this. I did break myself into it easily, but man, I am having some growing pains to say the least. Now, am I throwing in the towel? Absolutely not. I am going to soldier through it 120 days. This is only the start. But on the agenda for today, if this is the first time you're here to the Weekend Hack channel, hit the subscribe button, hit that thumbs up. It helps the channel out a lot. This is a 12.8 handicapper's journey myself on training speed, training weight, getting into better shape to hopefully drop bombs in my tournaments next year in 2021. If you're into speed training, if you're into hitting the ball further, if you're into tips and tricks, this is the series for you. Today, I'm about to head out to the Fairway Factory, AKA my at-home driving range in my garage, and we're gonna see how far I am averaging on my drives, my carry distance, according to the Swain Caddy, and if, in my second completed week of training, have I added more swing speed to my swing? I believe I was a little bit over 94 miles per hour, up from 92 from my base. I started out at 92, I'm up to 94. But like I just said, I've been battling some back pain. I'm feeling about 80, 85% but I am gonna go out there, get uh, nice and loosened up, and I'm gonna try to drop some Bryson bombs. All right, so we are here in the Fairway Factory. I've warmed up. Gonna be hitting 10 drives as always. I have the swing caddy up and running. It is good to go. We will be seeing how far I average carry my drives according to the swing caddy, as well as my ball and swing speed. Last week's swing speed was 94.1. Hopefully, getting to 95 today. Whew. Let's hit our 10. Woo! 99. Have never hit 100 yet. Swing two. Swing three. Swing 
four. Swain six. Swain seven. Swing eight. Swing nine. Two left. Last one of the ten. Try to give this all we have. Not bad. Whew. So that is our ten swings for the day. I will put the average distance right here, but I think it was in the 240s. I hit 99 mile per hour swing speed on one swing, have never hit that high yet, still have not seen triple digits, interested as well to see what my ball speed is, but it's been two completed weeks of training, despite my back pain, a little bit of back pain, I am feeling good, I am feeling strong. This is a whole nother week of douche to Shambeau. I'm into week three now. Hopefully get out to play this week and got snowed out this week plus my back. But the swing is feeling good as always, guys. If you like this content, hit it with a thumbs up. Remember, it's always an option to subscribe to the Weekend Hack. Till the next time.